This episode is sponsored by AwesomeDrinks.com. This month, I turned 38, so save 15% using coupon code GREAT in 38. Welcome to Call Man Cocktails. I am your host, Derek Show, but I go with me, Ian Andrews, and we're going to be making a cocktail called The Absolute Screwed Up. Really? Mm-hmm. And it's got absolute in it. It does. That's nope. fitting. Yeah, it's not really screwed up. <laughs> oh, oh it's a play on screwdriver. <laughs> <laughs> so right. we would have more orange juice, but Ian decided to put it in on red and drink it. And we don't need more. <laughs> no, I don't. I just wanted to okay. say that you well, did that. Yeah, let's call me out on something that doesn't matter. <laughs> <laughs> That's pretty much what I just did, Holmes. <laughs> let's do that. <laughs> so one ounce, okay, we got one ounce absolute, one ounce triple sec, one ounce orange juice, top with ginger ale. Yep. Oh, Jesus. And dirty ice. <laughs> dirty ice. My, my thing okay. isn't dirty. Build over ice? It's spill over ice. We're going to shake it a little bit. Don't, I don't know why. We're shaking with the soda in yep. it. Yep. Okay. I put warning, shake slowly. <laughs> That was my own warning. They didn't give me one. They're like, oh, shake it with soda. So I don't wash this bottle. I probably did. Doesn't matter. It's almost done. You do you make sure we have enough in there? Nope. You're gonna overpour, aren't you? Nope. Oh. Oh well, I thought we needed a half ounce, but we need an ounce. No, it's now I'm wondering if I'm enough. Yeah, that's enough. You have a whole other bottle. bottle. Oh, I know. I was just wondering if you're gonna die. Finish this bottle for me. Yep, it's happening. (laughs) All right. I'm just gonna finish with the drink and let you do your thing, and then I'm gonna do it. Oh. Thanks for the shower. Oh. Top. Top. No, we don't need OJ for anything else, do we? This is where it gets scary. I'm, I'm not I'm not 100% sold on this idea. Cheetah tin. Now, I'm going to use the cheetah tin. That's Massachusetts for cheater tin. <laughs> or 16 ounce don't cocktail. Don't make me get up and hit you. And that's not a Weezer album. That's no. Pinkerton. <laughs> And I'm going to give this a Also, the Academy. I will kick your butt in front of everybody. Yep, that happened. It's still happening. Yeah. It's just a bad idea, but that's why they have these. When you shake carbonated beverages, they leak. Yeah. I learned that. But most bartenders would have like a a bar napkin or something that they can shake it with. Mm. Because you know it's going to happen. But you're not a bartender. Nope. He's just a common man making cocktails. Oh, this is submitted by Will. Oddly, it smells like vodka. Which is weird, because vodka shouldn't have a smell. But it could just be something else. Oh. Huh. Hmm. <laughs> Makes me think of a drink that you drink with a barbecue for some reason. With a barbecue? And you know, when you're looking at me like that, I was like, oh, he's on the same thing I'm thinking. I was completely wrong. <laughs> <laughs> it's got like a... It's got a taste to it. It does have a taste. <laughs> and it, I can't put my finger on this I taste. I can't either. But, mm-hmm. we, we, yeah. It's almost absinthe, right? Like a... Yeah. <laughs> I don't know why. And it's nothing to do with the fact that we're just drinking absinthe. But. No. I don't... It's got a lot of orange in the finish. Mm. Like, not orange juice, obviously, but like a citrus. Um, I don't really like it, honestly. I think it's a little... Um, it's the ginger ale that's giving it that up. flavor, obviously. It is a little screwed up. No, it's kind of giving me a headache. I don't mm. know why. I don't like screwdrivers to start with myself. I had a bad experience. Well, the bad experiences are never good. That's why they call them bad. <laughs> smack you. <laughs> and your entrepreneurial spirit. <laughs> I'm sorry you made nothing of your life, Ian. <laughs> <laughs> sorry, the best is yet to come. Because well, nothing good else happened yet. Hey, you gave a strippers. You've been there. So. Mm. That's our topic. <laughs> <laughs> it always is. Don't go there. Um, there's nothing. I'm gonna let it cancel, right? No, there's. It's just. If you like a screwdriver, it's a change. It's a light it's a screwdriver. Like I would rather drink a screwdriver. The carbonation, mm. the flavor, the the there's ginger. Not a lot of carbonation in here right now. It got shaken out. <laughs> I know, but it you tastes that, weird to me. It's got like a sour. You get the flat ginger ale flavor. Don't no! Oh, I thought you were gonna shake all the. Goodness oh. out of it. Oh, I'm going to make sure that That's this what tastes... I do to my bottles of Coke. I'm going to make sure it tastes right. Yeah, she shakes the flatness mm. into her shit. I do that with my polar water. Polar water? It's too water. carbonated. Really? That soda is too this carbonated. This is super carbonated. I love carbonation, mm. so I carved the hell out of this soda stream right here. You can see the bubbles popping up. That and it's fresh. It doesn't taste weird. I didn't know if this tasted <laughs> yeah, weird or something. Weird. Mm. You were going to blame it on the ginger. I was. I was trying to blame it on something. No, that's... Just blame it on the drink. It's tasty. Blame it on the rain. Yeah. 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 Name that band. Millie Vanilli? Yeah. Yep. Millie I don't know if that's going to be viewers, but never mind. <laughs> I 
don't need a bunch of people running Milli Vanilli. <laughs> that would drive me crazy. It'll be the most internet hits they've had in years. Come on. <laughs> <laughs> this is true. We'll have to link them. Like their page. They... Girl, you know it's true. <laughs> oh, ooh, 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 love you. Now I remember what I hated about the 80s and 90s. Uh, <laughs> the lip syncing yeah. hair twins. Yeah. I, 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 whatever. Well, I'm going to get some props for that Milla Vanilla reference yeah. when people watch this video. Just wait. <laughs> All right. And I'm not, I'm not, I'm, I'm saying all right. out there. I'm not saying anything because I could be, you know, that could actually happen. Yep. Um, I, don't have a I got props today. for mentioning skull fucking one time. So. <laughs> That's true. Oh, I like how you were skull fucking in that conversation. <laughs> Five points to Rick yeah. Epnor. <laughs> um, <laughs> I got something going on. Uh, not a fan. I yeah. don't really know why. I just, it's, I think it's the citrus and the ginger together combined doesn't do anything for me. There's nothing wowing about this drink. No, I'm not wow. Mm. I'm sorry, Will. Maybe a summer, like a, maybe a spring drink or a summer drink, lawnmower beverage. It could be, but you know what? You say lawnmower? Yeah. Yep. Something you drink on a lawnmower and you're operating yeah. heavy machinery. Yeah. This is well, the they, they, call, they call like light beers like lawnmower beers. Oh. Because it's something you're going to drink while you you're just drink. sitting out and you can just drink it. It's like water. While on the lawnmower? Yeah, it's a good lawnmower beer. This is when you're doing when you're doing like outdoor tasks. Right. When I'm on a lawnmower, I wouldn't want this. What I'd want I is want I just water. got a scorpion. I want a cold beer. It's damn hot. Oh, I was thinking a scorpion bowl, just like right in my hand. I was thinking water. That's a great idea. Dude, question. Damn dog. <laughs> do you think you'd actually get somebody would actually pull over and go, well, "What are you doing?" I think they would just be like, "Whatever." No, I mean people drink beer out there a lot more. Why not? No, it's Scorpio. <laughs> no, oh, yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> I don't like, think oh, wait a minute. Anything. What's in that? I don't, think, I don't think anybody would tell me What's to say anything. in that? No. Don't think I don't have a question of the day, so. Um, you have to make one up. Okay. Question of the day. How much carbonation do you like in your cocktails? What else you got? I'm going to say, what's your favorite beer? But what's your favorite beer? You probably don't Don't say Lime Marita or Strawberry. That's not a beer. That's it's a malt beverage. beverage. Yeah, that's a malt Don't beverage. say juice or fucking four loco. That's not beer either. Juice? Juice. Oh. Yeah. J O O S E. I heard of that. Oh, yeah. Wasn't that also a streaming that. video service Might at one point? Been. Might have been. Oh, it was juiced. Never mind. Anyway. <laughs> I don't know. Pick, pick, pick your favorite beer, right? When we're talking about beer, we're talking about something with barley, hops, water, and yeast. Right, Heights Kabot. Magic Hat number nine. Heights Kabot. After win. Yeah. You like Magic Hat number nine? I do yeah. like Magic Hat. Magic Hat number nine? I don't really drink beer though, so. Mm. Trevor Dog. They have a banana. But I do like red ale too. Red ban Apple's ale. Banana Francis bread. Connor. Banana bread flavored ale. Do they really? Yeah, it's really good. Oh, yeah, that bread. sounds good. I'll have to find some. You might like it. Evenbry. Uh, uh, Vox Diner. Um, Francis Connor. Francis Connor. What's Sam your Smith. favorite summer lawn chair drink? Lawn chair drink? I like gin tonic. I'm, I'm a gin tonic guy. I like gin tonic. If I were to sit, well, if for me, maybe it would a little be, bit of uh, Saint Germain in it. Yum yum. For me, it would be iced tea. Some but cucumber. If, if we were to cucumber. imagine that I would be drinking alcohol sitting in a lawn chair, I would probably say my time. I like to go hardcore. Yeah, yeah, I can see you doing that. Uh, That's my boss's. I think he loves my time. Yeah, so. he's half Taiwanese though, so it only makes sense. Yeah, there you go. All right, let's We're wrap done. this up. Right. EverydayDrinkers.com. Recipe edit at, at EverydayDrinkers.com. That's where you submit recipes for the show. Uh, Patreon.com slash CMC. If you'd like to support us and fund us and make us make us some love, got another $10 donation this month. Or you could just go to AwesomeDrinks.com and buy some shit. Or like glasses or steppers or... Oh, yeah, we can go there. That's a good idea. Yeah. That's a, that's a fabulous highball. I think that's why. Highball. Yeah, fabulous highball. Boom! I like this one for when I need to use the cheater tin because yeah. the, the other ones like these, these are nice, but the, it doesn't fit. Like, no. <laughs> and we go the opposite direction. Yeah, right? Can you do that? <laughs> you cheat? No, it doesn't work so well. No. So that's why I do it this way. Done. Using that drink. We're done! We're taking a drink!